by Shim Sun Ah Sol, June 18, Yon Hap, acclaimed director Kim Ji Woon's long anticipated sci fi thriller, In Rang, was partly unveiled to media on Monday. Set in 2029, with the two Koreas having agreed to launch a unified government, South Korean police launches a special unit to stop an anti reunification terrorist group called Sect. Feeling threatened by the growing influence of the formidable police unit, the state intelligence agency plots to destroy it. As they engage in a veiled battle, rumors that the unit has secret human weapons, called wolves, spread quickly across the country. The title, In Rang, comes from the Korean word meaning, werewolf. In the movie, you can see a man who is raised to be a human weapon but is torn between conflicting values inside of him through the main character named him, Jung Kyung, Kim said during a press conference to promote the forthcoming film at a Seoul theater. It is a Korean live-action adaptation of the Japanese animated film masterpiece, The Wolf Brigade, by Hiroyuki Okiura. Kim said it was a reckless decision to remake the animated work but he made every effort not to disappoint the original movie's fans. The fans probably had both anticipation and anxiety for the live-action version of the film. I felt the same way. I was more anxious because I was the one who made the film and thought it was too much of a reckless decision. I knew the film is going to be criticized whether it is good or not. But this situation made me work harder than ever, he recalled. I never thought I would do films like this kind after, the good, the bad, the weird, I was very sick while making the new movie and I'm still sick. It is the title that hurt my health the most Gang Dong Won plays Im Jung Kyung, a highly trained member of a special police unit assigned to quell the terrorists. After, a girl in a red cape detonated herself right in front of his eyes while on a mission to secretly carry a bomb, Im visits the girl's elder sister, Lee Yoon Hee, played by Han Hyo Du, to deliver her belongings. After the encounter, he sways between his mission that forces him to be a beast and his feelings toward her. It marks Gang's second work with the director after the 30-minute short film, The X, made for Screen X immersive screening system. I received a call from Kim's assistant director about 2012, Gang answered when asked how he came to take the role. I accepted the offer at that time and it took six years for the film to come out. For the warrior role, Gang had to adapt himself to a power suit that weighs more than 40 kilograms. I couldn't even walk in the outfit at first, but my body felt comfortable with it after a week. And then the director asked me to run, so I ran. He later made me fight hand to hand with a suit on, he said. Han Hyo Ju said playing Lee Yoon Hee was a big challenge for her as an actress. It was the most difficult role that I have ever delivered. I agonized a lot over how to carry out the role well from the very beginning because it was a very complicated character, she said. But I gradually felt comfortable and friendly with the character, coming to understand what the director meant to express and feel the atmosphere of the set. The film also stars Young Woo Sung as Jang Jin Tae, chief of the training camp for the police unit, and Chinese Choi Min Ho as Jang's right-armed man and leading member of the special police unit. Presented by Warner Brothers. Pictures, in Rang, opens in local theaters on July the 25th, https colon slash slash youtube.be slash u7 of Lee closing square bracket, end.